Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another vlog. I just got a blowout at Dry Bar. It is a super windy day today. Heading to brunch now at Bouvette. Just hang out with Charlene and Alicia for a little bit. And then, as you can tell from the title, we're doing a staycation at a dream property of mine, which is Amon, New York. So very excited to bring you guys along. where they invited me to stay for the weekend and I am here to create content for the property. I have been such a huge fan of Amman hotels for years, but never had the opportunity to stay in one of their hotels. So I feel very honored to have been invited to stay at the New York property, which just opened in August. I'm very excited to show you guys the property and also give you a little tour. So this morning I met up with Charlene and Alicia for a little brunch. And now I'm here waiting for Marco. They do have an itinerary for us for the weekend, but as always, we're gonna kick things off with a room tour. All right, so this is the door that we enter from, and then immediately to your right, there is kind of like this drop-off section, put bags, I have my camera over there, and the hotel keys. Down here is just some additional storage, great for the luggage rack, and then also a great place to put shoes. I actually really love this design. Might wanna incorporate this whenever Marco and I do a build. We walk in, this is the corridor where we have closets to the left and the bathroom to the right. Beautiful double vanity. And I just love how enclosed this space is, but you can opt to open it up with these panels that just kind of rotate on the side. Got a little vanity area over here, and also just really obsessed with this tub just because how low and wide it is. This is gonna be a great place to soak, and I'm just very excited about it. Genuinely geeking out over all of the materials that they did, just because everything is so organic. Amon Properties started in Thailand. Most of their properties are in Asia, but they are expanding a little bit in the US, so, there's Amon Geary and then they have Amon New York. And I just love how peaceful it is inside the hotel. It really feels so relaxing, so serene. I literally can't even hear outside and I'm on the Upper East Side. Like I'm literally on the corner of 5th and 57th. This place just feels like such an escape from how busy it is outside. Through this door is the shower, which is humongous. And I just love how enclosed it is because you could really feel so, I mean, if you don't like dark spaces, it might not be your vibe, but if you just want some peace and quiet in a shower, got a bench over here. Sorry about the echo. In here, we've got the best of the best, a Toto toilet, which is great because I love these. Got all of the buttons, bells and whistles that you May need. Love the design of these closets because everything is just so seamless. All the different textures just work so well together. So I just have my coat hanging in this one. I have some bags in this one. And then over here we have a little coffee maker. Just pops open. We've got tons of storage space. Over here, we got some wine glasses, some snacks, drawer for all of our beverages. Let's see, utensils over here. Love everything in this room. 
love how organic all of this is and it's just so well done and when you do hospitality design every little detail counts so i love all of this even over here we've got the safe and all of these drawers as well and i'm assuming just some additional storage in here as well now we're going to make our way into the main space where we have this beautiful king size bed obsessed with the walls and the decor just love this panel over here and of course this stunning fireplace got a nice little chaise lounge on the right and a little seating area on the left so this will be a great place for marco and i to enjoy breakfast we're here for two nights so definitely in room dining for one breakfast and then downstairs for the other it's so calming so relaxing the lighting is perfect and we also have a tv and a little desk area over here as well so marco brought my vlog camera so i don't have that with me yet but i will be filming a lot during this weekend just so i can show you more about the property i'm going to be taking a couple of photos as well so need to do a bit of work I'm very excited to be here so grateful and just very excited to show you all what the amon new york property has done dinner reservations at Namo, which is so, so good. So Marco has recently just discovered that he's not allergic to fish as he has been thinking his entire life because I told him to go and get an allergy test just to make sure. Turns out he is only allergic to tuna, so now he is entering this whole world of sushi and trying out what fishes he likes. So it's a very exciting time to be Marco's stomach. But Namo was delicious. They also have an omakase table and the chefs were just incredible. So we sat in front of them and it was just so cool seeing them prepare everything. So highly, highly recommend. After that, we had reservations at the Jazz Club, which is also here in the hotel. So we did some late night drinks, got to enjoy watching Brooklyn Soul perform. They were amazing and it was just a great Friday night out. Well, out, but also kind of in because it's at the hotel. So it was a lot of fun and now we are just going to unwind. I think I'm just gonna have like a nice bubble bath because that tub is too good to pass up. We have breakfast tomorrow. We're gonna eat at the Arva restaurant and then we'll probably do in-room breakfast for Sunday before checking out. So that's it for tonight. I'll see you guys in the morning.
we took a little break in the room. I shot a bit more and then had to edit a couple of things. Now we are on our way to the spa. Got the langoustine pasta, got fries, Brussels sprouts, and Marco got the chicken. Moved on to dessert. Can't say no to a tiramisu. had such a good night's sleep. I swear that this bed is a California king because it's humongous, but this room is so beautiful. The property is stunning and all of the food has been so amazing. Uh, just gonna finish breakfast and then I'm gonna take you guys around a couple other details in the hotel that I feel like were very thoughtful. And then after we check out, we are heading to Queens because today is actually my mom's birthday. So getting together with family, but I'll probably just end up wrapping up the vlog before that. So see you guys in a bit. So I always just love how the details in this room just work so well together and it just blends so nice and seamlessly. So I love the back panels that they did for kind of like a little feature behind the bed. Built in are the switches for the room. So these are all the different light settings. That's for the bathroom. And then you can adjust everything, curtain, shade. This is for making up the room. And then the TV actually goes up and down. This and the TV just pops up. I think that's what I want for a bedroom. This table also has a couple of little light features and also just love the material that they chose for this bedside table. I am going to miss waking up and having this bathroom. So in here we have, I wanted to show this because I didn't notice this till recently, but this hotel comes fully stocked with toothbrush, Marvis toothpaste, which is really good. Might have to bring that back with me. Got some mouthwash, and sometimes like hotels don't even have this stuff. So it's nice, that's all in here. They also have a Dyson because why not? You know, love that. Amman has tons of properties around the world. I need to get myself one of these books. Uh, there's like a little bookmark in here and it opens up to the Amman New York page. They have one in the Philippines that I've been dying to go to, but Amman Puri is the very first one that they had that's in Thailand. But all of their Asia properties are just insane. This is Amman Puri. This is like their very first one. It was like opened in the 80s, I think. 1988. Look at this. So crazy. They are opening a couple of other in the North Americas. Uh, there's one in Miami that's supposed to open. 
and also Beverly Hills was one that we saw, right? Yeah, Beverly Hills and Miami. And Miami. So, very exciting stuff. I took a lot of photos and video content, so I'm going to have a lot more on my Instagram in terms of just like carousels and reels. So, very excited to share that with you all. Just enjoying like our last few hours here at the hotel and then we'll be heading out. Okay everyone, time to check out and say farewell to one of the most stunning hotel rooms I have ever stayed in. So thank you so much to Amon New York for hosting for the weekend and hopefully be back soon. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!